How's it going, guys? It's Rockman 5 Welcome back to more Let's Play Luigi's Mansion 2: Dark Moon. The last time we did Mission One of Secret Mine Cold Case, and then in this part we're going to be doing Mission Two of Secret Mine. Hit rock bottom. Here we go. I'm still mad about that that bronze rank though. That bronze rank, man. I thought I so thought I did better than what I did. Huh? Ghosts and crystals. I wonder why. They don't look like they want to be in there. And apparently the booze put them in there. Hmm. Interesting. Very interesting. What's that little thing right there? Where's the portal? Hmm. Well, I guess we can't tell. Is that the painting again? They've been dra- yeah, they have been dragging all around Overshade Valley. We've been seeing it since Haunted Towers. And then it seemed to be extracting crystals from the quarry. Hmm. So they're putting ghosts in the crystals, for some reason, and they're still carrying the painting around Overshade Valley. Very odd. Why the boo- why the boo's putting- and who is commanding them? Hmm, I wonder who is commanding them. Yeah, and we did hear, hear sinister laughter come from the bottom of the mine. It was really odd. I remember that. And the only way to find out is to, if we investigate the crystal quarry, and that's where those ghosts are being held and the, the booze are being dicks. And you'll find my E-gates on the way there. Don't be afraid to use them. Yeah, the E-gates are uh, kind of a cool aspect. They're like little portals you can go through. It's it's kind of cool, and you can carry items through and stuff. It's nice. I like it a lot. Oh man. My back is killing me right now. This is attempt number three of trying to record this freaking part. I got interrupted twice in, like... It was it was freaking insane. It was so annoying. Interrupted twice. First by my brother and his friend, and then my mom walked in. And it's like, oh my god, it's so annoying. Sorry, if, actually, sorry. If there was a little bit of blur right there. I actually turned 3D on for a little bit. My bad. Uh, what you're gonna want to do is uh, use your dark lens rocking chair right here because this will reveal the boo. What's your name, son? I'm Booger. Why must you always pick on me? I don't. But here's Booger right here, so he's got 30 HP. Let's get him to third level. Get wrecked, Booger. Last time, uh, before the before I failed, that the second the second time, but I was able to get him to one HP. Oh, this stupid fucking thing. Where's the boo? Where's he at? Where's the boo? Where's? Oh, there he is. Meow, meow. Let's just get him to second level, and boom, shakalaka. There we go. These these enemies, I don't even know what they're called. There's little fuzzballs that just annoy the living crap out of you. They're just annoying enemies that are just completely pointless, personally. What's, what's shaking in here? And it's a gold one. And these things, those things actually are a bit useful, because when you uh, shoot them, money pops out. So it'll help your money counter, because money's always good, you know. Get you a better rank, get you upgrades, you know. It's helpful. Alright, so now we're going down, and we're in the airway. Our goal is to get to B3, because that's where the crystal quarry is, so, yeah. Man, I r I've been trying to stay in a good mood this all day, ever all day, ever since I got home from school, but after, first, when I first got home, the internet was bad, and then after two interruptions with recordings, I'm just starting to get into a bad mood, and I really don't want to get into a bad mood. But uh, here we have our, here are the E-gates. And here's a little cutscene with them. It's kind of a little bit of funny cutscene, you'll see. It doesn't hurt Luigi, it's alright. So he puts his hand in there, and... Check this out. You can see it from the other side, see? The gates are teleporters. Hello. He said hi to himself, this is... Hello! <laughs> Hello. It's yeah, it is me. It's, it's my hand. Oh, yeah. yeah, I get it. And all you have to do is go in and just uh, hit X and interact with them, and you get to the other side. And as you can... And, uh... Right here, we cannot go with this door. And we can't, uh, you, and the key is not usable either. But what you want to do is, uh, take it through the E-gate. Yes, I said before, you can take objects through the E-gate. And you want to, uh, use it on this fire lamp over here. And boom, we got our key. Now we can progress. One step closer. Oh, yes, we are one step closer to solving this mystery. Why are the ghosts in the crystals? Why are the boos putting them there? Who's leading the boo? Next, on Let's Play, we just to do Dark Moon. <laughs> Alright, so now we got one of these uh, little uh, belly slide things again, like we saw in Old Clockworks on Mission 2. But, uh, what we're gonna do is go over here so you can uh, get to the key. And Luigi's like, whoa! No, I wanna get over there! I wanna get over there! No! I'm pretty sure you can get a gem if you go to the right, but it's, the, the timing is really weird. It's almost like luck It's almost luck based. Uh, this E gate right here, uh, as you can see, that E gate just right behind us, it just takes you back to the top of the skip slope. Uh, yeah, I wanna. I'm trying to get this rope right here because it reveals, uh, three gold mice. You just gotta wait for the bucket to kind of, uh, run into itself. You'll see. And it's gonna do it right there. Boom! And we got our three gold bars. Hella moolah. And as you can see, these lockers are, uh, blocking the path. 
So what we're gonna do is uh, interact with the barrel and start sucking on this uh, sucking on this thing right here. And then the lockers will be raised and we can move on. All right, what do we got right here? What room is this? This is the smuggler's hideout. And what you're gonna wanna do is uh, grab this burned log and uh, melt these ice cubes right here because this will get you a little bit more extra money. The knight stabs that knight's head and a bunch of gold bats come out so you can boom, get them all and you get tons of dollar bills right there. Help a lot. And there's also some uh, spare coins right there too if you wanna grab those. So let's grab this log and uh, melt this pathway so we can continue on even more. Sneakers! Oh my god. Come here, you! Stupid sneaker. Okay, I'll let him drag me a little bit. Boom! There we go. Aw, oh, dang. Okay, let's just suck this log off him right here. Boom! Let's get... Okay. Yeah, this... One of them has uh, the, the force field, so you gotta get him to at least green. And there we go. Boom. And you cannot progress until you uh, shut this door shut with the L button. You just gotta uh, blow on it instead of sucking. Uh, and you can use your dark light to get this painting activated so you can get tons of coins also. It's just handing us money all over the place. We're gonna be rich. Rich, I tells ya! Rich! <laughs> oh, I love money. I really do love money. I hate, I hate, I just, I hate spending money so much. We're on the shaft, uh, just use your L button so you can get lower and lower because our objective is to get low. Come on, grab some coins right here. Right now we have 310, that's really good. We haven't lost any health yet either, so we're doing pretty good in this mission. Maybe we can actually get gold rank. That'll make up for our crappy bronze. Looks like those ghosts are carrying crystals as well. Oh, look, it's a gold speedy spirit. <laughs> nice cute. Hmm. What's going on right here? Why can't we... Okay, okay, I guess we can't keep going. Just stop for a sec right there. Aw. That's weird. It's not, not dark anymore. I guess it's light. Yeah, if you just uh see that path with the keys, just a bunch of bats come out. You'll see. Watch. See, it's... It's good, it's better if you uh, do it lower so the bats won't run into you. Uh, I don't remember what this pulley does right here, let's see. Nothing, okay. I guess it's just there. I guess it's one of those luck-based things. Uh, okay, let's interact with this right here. Do we need to turn it? Yep, we do need to turn it. Is it gonna open a door? What's it gonna do? Oh, it's gonna flip us to the other side. Coward's chasm. It's funny because Luigi isn't a coward, you dicks. And this is kind of a confusing room. See, you're gonna have to go around over here. It's one of those really weird rooms. It's almost like a mirror. It's, it's odd. Uh, what's, the, what's this do? We blow on this. Oh, I think, th oh uh, yeah, you wanna lower this down to that cave, that mini cave over there, and I think this will cause some bats to come out if I'm not mistaken. Do we have to lower it even lower? Oh, yep, there are the bats. Gold bats, be exact. Can we get some? Okay, at least we got one. Okay, let's get him. Let's get them. Oh, I guess we had to use a strobe. I guess we have to use the strobe light to um, get them. But now we're in the deep hall. Egan, let's call him. Let's see what the reception is. We're all the way down in basement level three. Let's find out. Yep, Luigi, are you there? I can barely hear you. Probably made it to the very bottom of the mine. So far, so good. The crystal quarry should be nearby. Try to find find a way in. Alright, so, reception is really bad. Can we, uh, look through here? No, I guess not. Uh, pull on this to reveal, to get one of the things off of the door. And the other thing, you have to melt, but we cannot melt that just yet. Uh, I forget what happens if you do here. I think if you blow, uh, if you get this, uh, kettle onto the fire for long enough, it does something, but I don't exactly remember. I think it just gives you money. And, oh, no, no, it gives you hearts. I didn't even need those hearts either. Um, 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 okay, we cannot go in there yet. A uh, little bit of somewhat puzzle right here. Not really, though. We're in the pit mine, so let's lower a little bit more. Lower, lower, lower. A little bit more shafts. Dance, 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 dance. I love doing that. Uh, you're going to want to pull in this rope so the conveyor belt will start going down. Bugs! I hate these freaking bugs! Oh, we got a heart. And what, what happens now? What the f- what? Oh yeah, you gotta start, uh, so you gotta start, uh, sucking on this thing right here. And then the, uh, coal will start getting dis distributed, and the coal will go through the E-gates. You'll, uh, see right here, I think it'll show a little bit of cutscene, yeah. You see the coal goes through the E-gate, 
and it goes out the other side. And we need to use this coal to melt the ice cube so we can progress. Uh, come on, Luigi. I am enough, but I didn't even think I hit X. Alright. Yeah, you, you gotta take the coal and uh, bring it over to the fire so it can get all hot so it can melt the ice. So uh, let's just grab one of these coal pieces right here and get it all hot and such. Aim and fire! There we go. There reveals another pulley, or another chain that we can pull on. Boom! And now the door is revealed. Let's go. We're in the cinder mine now. Hmm. And there's another key. Let's uh, just blow on this and see what happens. Fire! And uh, you may think, hmm, what do I do with that fire? Well, there's a log in this corner if you can really see it that well, so. Just burn that. I think. Wait. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, you gotta bring it over here. And then, uh, then you can, then you can, uh, get the coal, I believe. You gotta melt this path. Okay, let's grab that, okay. And then there's some coal in this bag right here that you can grab. Cause you gotta, you gotta shoot it up because the log can't reach it, so. There we go, boom! Luigi, you are a pro shot. I bet you, I bet your KD is like 5.2 on Call of Duty. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Huh, I wonder, is there ghosts in here now? <gasps> there is ghosts. Ah! Boom! Get him. One of them's carrying a crystal, one of them's wearing a mask. And there's only two. Nice. Now we can go in here because we got our key. This should be the crystal quarry, if I'm not mistaken. Yep, it is. The ghosts are in the crystal. Oh, they want to leave. They're aw. Look at the sneakers and the greenies. Booze. Dicks. What did you do to the What did you do to the ghosts? <gasps> They're, they escaped. <gasps> It looks like they really don't. <gasps> huh? Looks like the crystals made them are making them super. I guess that I guess that was I guess that how that uh, I guess that's how that super sneaker got all powerful and old clockworks. I guess. No, let's look in. Where are you? <gasps> sneaker. <gasps> What's going on in there? <gasps> he got out. Looks like we're gonna have to fight you, sir. Let's get him. He's got 100 HP now, the last one only had 50. Almost there, and got him. And now, the other two are going to break out. So we're going to want to try to get them at the same time as best as we can. Boom, there we go, this is going to be hard. Let's get him to third level, boom! Okay, we got the granny, now, we're just, now we can just focus on the slammer. Get him to third level again. See, these ghosts are a lot more powerful. I believe they can do more damage, and they have a ton more HP. They have, like, triple of what they have. Like, the Slammers usually have 30, but they have 150. Actually, it might be even times 5. I think about it. No, it's like, well, I don't know. It's, it's weird. I think it's times, sometimes times 4, sometimes times 5. It's it's odd. Because it's t it's only times 4 with the, the Sneakers, but it's times 5 with the Slammers and the Greenies. Because the greenies have usually 10, but they have 50 in there. So it, when they have 50 when they're uh, all powerful and stuff. But yeah, we completed the mission. We figured out what the crystals are doing. The crystals are causing the ghosts to become uh, super powered. So they're like genetically altering them or some shit. And we got a silver rank. Alright, I can live with that. 10 minutes. Maybe if we lost a little bit of health or maybe got a little bit faster clear time. I know. Uh, the, only, the only health we, we lost was because of from those bugs. In the like that, like I said, the game knows those enemies are annoying. They wouldn't have put them in the Belfry clock fight if they weren't annoying. They put them, I'm, I'm pretty sure, in three different hour times too. I'm pretty sure it's, I don't know, remember which times, but I'm pretty sure it was at least two separate hour times. That's that's how bad they are. All right, let's see what Egad's got to tell us right here. Good to see you back here, Luigi. Let's see what we got. Definitely got some spectral masses updated for sure. Let's see. Yep, new ghosts. Oh, not new ghosts, but the spectral mass was updated for the sneakers because we already encountered a super sneaker back in old Clockworks. But yeah, we have the soup. We now have uh, captured super grannies and super slammers. Hmm. He's got a theory. That's strong. That's strong. Yeah, I was. I was thinking about that. Yeah, he was. Uh, he must have been crystallized because yeah, I was talking about that before you again. I said it first. You didn't. Gay. Who could orchestrate such a thing? Yeah, you're right. Who could orchestrate? Dun 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 dun. dun, dun. Da, 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 da. Yeah, we got the silver rank, and we got the boo. Alright, so, 
Next time on Let's Play Luigi's Mansion 2 Dark Moon, we're going to be doing the last main mission of Secret Mine, D-3, Across the Chasm. So I'll see you guys next time. Peace out. Take care. Bye-bye.